everyone. Welcome to our channel, Rebecca's Do in the Crew. I'm Rebecca, and it's Friday, which means it's time for our weekly What's New at the Dollar Tree video, and this will be for the week of April 22nd, 2022. So I went to five different stores this week, and all of the pictures are put together in this video, separated by sections of the store. If I go too fast, please just push pause. It's a really long video, and there's lots to get through. So let's go shopping. We're going to start in apparel and accessories this week. And they had some new bandana sets out. You get two bandanas for $1.25. This is the blue, white, and black floral pattern. They also had this two pack with the tie dye and the soft pastels. And the second one was a mint green one with some paisleys on it. And then they had this floral pattern with the soft pastels. And the second bandana was a soft peach color. And it had the white paisleys on it as well. Again, you get two in each pack for $1.25. Then they had these mossy oak socks. These are the full cushion thermal socks. It says extreme heat. You get one pair. They have the red top there and those were um it said that they were men's socks they also had this four different um scars this week in the black gray and white uh patterns here they had either the solid or the pattern so they had the solid gray solid black the gray one that says dream with stars on it and then the striped one they also had some more of the gilder brand performance t-shirts they had these in adult and children sizes and they are 100 percent poly performance that is moisture wicking they had them in extra small all the way to extra large and you could find them in black blue orange and white And they were all the short sleeve shirts. They also had some women's um, polo shirts this week in the extra small all the way to extra large. They had them in sage green and in a soft ballerina pink. And then I found some of these um, tank tops with a pocket. These are the comfort color uh, tank tops and they had them in extra large, large and medium and they are 100% cotton. I also found the Tri Blend Anvil Brand shirts and they were in a teal blue with a V-neck. Then they had these extra large tote bags with the color splash on the front and the black like silhouettes of the buildings. Also, they had their change purses. Um, I found three different ones. They have the metal top with the two little balls at the top for the closure. I thought these were really nice and they were in a plastic bin up by the socks. Over in Arts and Crafts this week, they had um, some more of the ceramic plaques that have the easel backing on them. So you get three different plaques. There's lots of different ways you could use these to decorate. You could use their glass ceramic markers that Dollar Tree sells, also the vinyl. You could use some acrylic paints. There's really lots of different ways that these could be decorated. You could even use some of the paint markers. Then they had some of these hanging plaques that are ceramic. You could get a circle, a tag, or a heart. The circle and the tag were definitely my favorite. The heart, not so much. It's kind of an odd shape. Um, but it, it's okay for what it is and for the price that you pay, but definitely the tag and the circle were my favorite. And they already have the um, hangers on them. They also had these natural color wood beads and squares or circles. I counted the beads, you get 35 beads on each strand, which is a great price for $1.25. There are some new chalkboards that were waiting to be stocked. They were still down in the aisle, but they are a square and a hexagon. Also some chalkboard signs, which were so cute. They have um, the mason jar. Also, you can get a heart and a star, and they have a twine hanger on the back already um, on with a raffia bow on the front. Some more of these metal wall plaques. They are an eight by 10 size. It's a wood frame with a tin board that you can use magnets on. You can put them all together to make a larger board if you like. And then they had some of the galvanized metal signs, which was a rooster, a cow, and a pig. They're about eight by six inches. They're depending on which animal you get. They're a little bit different sizes because of the shape. Also with the hangers already attached, some more of the floral hangers and the natural wood DIY boxes. Then they just had these plain boxes with a little bit of a deeper um, side on them. These do not have the lid with like the butterfly cutouts and whatnot. It is just the box. 
Also, they had these large wood planks that you could purchase. They have a hanger already attached to the top. So these are about 20 inches by five, or you can get the smaller ones, which were three inches by 12. And those also hang vertical with the hanger at the top. They had some more of their DIY craft wood pieces. And those were just on a box on the shelf. Also some more of the bamboo rings, which I've been using a lot in the craft videos that I post each week. And then these three um, word cutouts. These are like that MDF board and they're about an inch thick. You can see from the top here and those also already have a hanger attached, but they would work perfectly well sitting on a shelf. They had some five and a half foot garland, a bunch of different designs um, this year. So I love that they have all these different leaf patterns that you could purchase instead of just like the usual ones that they carry. Um, you get these smaller leaves. Here's a close up so you guys can see what they look like. They kind of have like a sharp jaggy edge to the leaf pattern they had some different color like multicolored ferns which i thought was my favorite it definitely was the most natural looking and then just a bunch of different um designs and patterns in the different leaves as you could see here these ones almost look like a heart shape and then they had some crafter square farmhouse uh, material so i love this they had the buffalo plaid and the gray also the solid black and gray or you could get the white with the um, gray stripes this has like a kind of a blackish gray, almost chalkboard look with different um, animals on the front. And then this one, I loved it. It had a bunch of different um, cities in Texas and towns. Also this one here with the chicken wire and the bumblebees with the mason jars, just so pretty. Over in Baby Needs this week, not a whole lot new there. They did have some more of the bandana style um, bibs out. And then a bunch of these rabbit skin onesie t-shirts. They have like a different color sleeve and trim. And then the t-shirt is gray. You can get them in purple, red, blue, and pink sleeves. And then all the shirts underneath were gray. Over in Health and Beauty this week with the cosmetics. Also not a whole lot new there this week. Um, our Majority of new items will be found in the home decor and seasonal items. They did have some more of the matte lipstick um, by City Color, and they have a bunch of the lip liner pencils to match. A lot of them say tester on the outside, but they're a full size bottle of lipstick. Then they had the um, lip liners and then these mirrors with the little hand mirror that comes attached. So you get the bonus mirror. Then in the hair care this week, not a whole lot new there as well, but they did have these new three packs of claw clips and they have these really pretty bright patterns on them. And there are three different packs with three different color schemes. In the pharmacy and personal care this week, they had these new travel bags. You get, I believe there's like five pieces and there's like a lotion, a shampoo bottle, a toothbrush cover, a small little container, and then a miniature loofah with the bag. And you can get them in blue, pink, white, and mint green. They also had their soothing sunburn relief gel out, which they just put out for the year. And then these um, hand sanitizers, you get four different ones in these glitter pouches and each one has a different scent. They had a whole bunch of the dial hand soaps like cherry blossom, the coconut um, mango water, Himalayan salt, vanilla honey, cedar balm, and then the Himalayan salt, which I think I already showed. Also, they had one that was called Marula Oil. So they have a whole bunch of different dial hand soaps out right now. And then for the fun find items this week, they had brought back out these really cute calendars where you can change the tags for the date. And they have these decorative backgrounds, which you can change. You just have to either peel the paper off, those little hooks unscrew, and it's really easy to DIY those calendars. They had some new photo albums also and some solid colors and printed patterns for the outside like the heart this constellation that says your future is bright and then this one with the roses on it that says every picture tells a story they also had some of their cosmetic bags that they had out last year for summer that say like just peachy they had a lemon one that says squeeze the day and then the kiwi fruit that says good vibes so they did have these out last year and they just brought them back i also found these journals that say just for today and on the front it actually says a guided journal for healing hope and daily care and inside there's these like guided pages to help you fill out your journal and i found two different journals 
in the um, box that was out on this shelf. For the home decor items this week, these are a repeat item that they had out last year with the galvanized metal background picture frames that have the hook on the front. And then they had these pictures that have like a little shelf right on the front there. You can see from the bottom how it's raised up off the side. It's got this easel back and then the clip on the front and um, each one of them just has this little shelf. You have to be careful though when you buy them. Some of the little shelves on the front were knocked off. Also, I found these lanterns that say Believe with the bumblebees on the front and Be Happy on the other side. And they have um, the battery operated light inside that you can change. And you just have to pull the little tab out to get the light to work. Also, these um, crosses that say Bless This Home, I Am With You, and Be Brave. And they are either in the blue, the black and white, or the light pink. Then these tea light candle holders are in metal. They have them in blue, pink, and yellow. And I'll pick one up so you guys can see it from the side to get a better view of what they actually look like. And they're a nice large tea light candle. I thought they were really pretty. Also, they had out some more of the mirrored home signs with the wreath on the O and the love sign. Um, the love sign has a black base. The white one has the white base. Also, they had these um, large flowers that were in these little pots, which were so cute. I thought that was a really great price for $1.25 since the flowers were so large and they already came in the pot with the faux soil wrapped around it. And there were six in all, so you can get three in this style of flower with different colors, or you could get these three here um, and the white, pink, and blue. And those are also in the same black pots. They also had some more of their springtime glass gnomes with the green, pink, and blue hats. Over in Housewares Home Maintenance and Organization, not a whole lot new there this week, but they did have these Hygienic Clean Soft Scrub Duo Cubes for the restroom. And it says that they are in the sapphire water scent. Then these um, wall hooks that you can use for like your brooms and things from Dollar Tree. I saw a, a tip on TikTok this week where some lady used them in their bathroom. They have a peel and stick on the back, which I didn't realize when I purchased them. And you can hang your curling irons under the bathroom sink. So I thought that was a great tip. Over in Kitchen and Pantry this week, they had a whole bunch of these Evian sparkling water. You get six cans for $1.25. They had the raspberry, the grapefruit, and basil also the cucumber and mint and then the last box that i found was the lime and ginger they also had some of their mason jar lids so you can use these as like lanterns and candle holders um, a bunch of different ones like the one with the mesh top here one with the um, hanger on it with the star cut out in the lid or the one where you can hang it from a chain they had these out last year also the canning snap lids you get 10 lids in the pack but it does not have the ring that goes around it. And then they had these really pretty coffee cups out this week and the um, sage green and gray with the monogrammed initials on the front. And these coordinate with a lot of the kitchen items I've been showing over the last few weeks, like these hot pad holders. They have oven mitts, also some kitchen towels. So if you guys are over in the kitchen aisle, make sure you guys check out these towels. They're really pretty. They also had some stretched canvas magnets that say, Be Kind, Daydream Believer, and one that says, Do Good. And then they also had some that were in like a black chalkboard kind of look that says, hello, welcome. The Wi-Fi for password is, and then you can write on the front with a piece of chalk to put down what your um, password is for your guests. Also, there's a view from the side. So you guys can see how thick those are. And now we'll move over into the home office supplies, just like the library and teaching tree section. They had the jot. Um, organizer bins for your desk, some of the Jot Magnetic List pads with the blue um, border, and it's got a um, fern at the top, or you can get the three count pack that has kind of like post-it notes at the bottom that you can tear away. They have like a perforated line at the bottom. Also the rainbow one here that says good vibes, and then they had the three count pack with the um, small little 
tearaway pages at the bottom of this one also. A few um, new books for the little ones. They have the um, pop-up pages in it and some of them have like the little lift flaps. You can see different pictures underneath which I know little kids like a lot and they had a whole bunch of new books out this week as well and then some of their chalkboard stickers. Also some new pencil cases. These are the plastic ones with the snap at the top and the tablet stands. Now in the party supply section this week, they had um, a bunch of new gift bags like this one that says, let's toast to your success. It's for the graduate. These are a smaller, uh, more on like the medium size bags. They have this one that says, you're kind of a big deal graduate. And then an avocado that says Brava Kit. Also um, the cookie, it says you're one smart cookie. And then they had this one that says you, you're a sharp one. They had some extra large bags for weddings and bridal showers out. There were four different ones. I love this one with the wood grain pattern and the flowers. So pretty. Also, they had out um, these new headbands. So these are metal and they are in gold that say bride. It's got a little diamond at the top to dot the eye. They had these burlap banners. It's so pretty. It comes with a string so you can string it up and then you can decorate each panel with your own letter or whatever you would like it to say. They also have this one that says just married. It actually comes with the letters already printed on the front and they are just squares or you can get the eight piece paper glasses for bridal showers. It says sip sip hooray. You get two of each pair. They had the white and gold uh, banners with the string and also comes with the letters so that you can um, spell out marry me. They also had the, um, it comes with like 15 different pieces and then they had these natural um, colored gift boxes. You get five in each pack. Then they had these fabric gift bags for Teacher Appreciation Day. Um, they're the burlap bags with the apples painted on the front. You get two of the same bags in each pack. You could also get one that says you are the best and best teacher ever. Over in the pet supplies this week, they had out these extra small bowls for really little dogs or puppies. Um, it just says it was a half pint and they come in three different sizes and they are all the stainless steel bowls. They also had these large gemstone style plastic bowls in the bright colors for summer. You can get the white bowl here that has all the colors of the bright bowls kind of mixed in together to do this like faux marble look. And then they also had them in pink. Then these um, dog bone toys here are like a mesh and they've got this like crinkly paper inside. So they make noise and they also squeak over in the seasonal items this week. We'll start with the Mother's Day items. So they had these signs out last week. I believe I showed them in the video and I only found the blue once it said mom. And then it's got this really pretty border um, at the bottom, which I thought made it really nice. This one says brave, strong, and love. And then this week I found them in pink and it says you're the best. They also had some coffee mugs. Let's say I got it from my mama. And then this one that says, love you to the moon and back. The third one I found was the best mom in the history of the world. And it has a um, world shaped like a heart. They also have the design your own coffee mugs restocked and a whole bunch of these round cylinder shaped style um, gift boxes with the floral designs. And they come in four different sizes and they're all the same price. Here they are stacked. You guys can see the different sizes. They have like a little truck on their front, butterflies and flowers. They also had these snow globes. Some of them you can add pictures to and they say different things geared towards Mother's Day. And there were four different ones to choose from and the little water heart shaped snow globes. Then they had these play water discs. They're like a spongy style disc that will suck up the water. They had them in yellow, blue and in red. I found some of their swim toys. So these are a 22 inch uh, in diameter float device. They have some that look like cookies, donuts, tires, uh, one that's like real colorful and it looks like each zipper is unzipping like the next color in the rainbow. And then they had some floatable like rafts. 
also some new 2020 graduate items like table decor. Uh, they had some like streamers, glasses, beach balls, um, some tinsel like hats, bubbles, a couple different things. And they were still putting out a lot of the items. They had some picture frames as well. So I'm sure we'll see some more items in the next few weeks. Here's a close up of some of the garland that they have. And then their yard signs and some signs that you could hang around for a party. There's some close ups, you guys could see them a little bit better. And here are the picture frames, it has like a little tassel attached, some of their new um, plates and things for grad parties. Then they had their Americana themed items like the fairy wings, some different bows. Uh, the bows are ones that they've had out the last few years. So those aren't new, but they do have them out in a few different sizes. They have their tinsel style um, garland and then the little like tinsel um, unicorn. They have this dog here. They've had those out the last few years. So those are not new, just a restocked item. They have a bunch of window cling sheets the 4th of July that say like Independence Day. Um, some that have like popsicles and things for the 4th of July. A bunch of different like USA stickers. They also have the balloon holders. It look like they have um, fireworks coming out of the top and those are in the red, white, and blue of course. And then the 12 count of the latex balloons with the stars on the front. Also the two packs of the party poppers. They also had some of their deco mesh in the red, white, and blue, or the stripes. The necklaces, you either get two or three, depending on which pack you get. So the stars here, you get three necklaces. And then the twisted beads, you get two. They also had some of these light up lanterns that say USA. And then a white one, it also lights up. It says America the Beautiful. There's a close-up of the tags. You guys can see that a little bit better. They have these tinsel stars in the red, white, and blue. It's a tabletop decor. And then the hanging tinsel hearts in the red, white, and blue. And one that is a star and another one that looks like a shooting star. Also, they had some hanging signs. They had um, Lady Liberty, the bunting that says America. And then this one here with the three different stars, it says America, America's in glitter. And then the faux um, pallet wood, that says home of the free and the brave. I love the USA, that's in glitter as well. They had some gnomes, you could get the taller, skinnier pointed hat or the traditional hat and then the um, like Uncle Sam hat. They also had the large gift tag style signs. Some of them have like a faux metal raised piece on it. The mason jar sign, so pretty. And then some of like the lays and yard decorations. They also had like the miniature flags. You could get them in a three pack. And then the large pinwheels also for the yard. And they had these really pretty new um, solar power garden stakes. It says it looks like a real flickering flame on the inside. They had some of their luau items out, like the um, seashell and coconut bikini tops, the grass skirts. And they just started to put out like their novelty sunglasses with like daisies, popsicles, flamingos. Um, they had some that looked like a mixed drink. couple different flamingos and then they had their felt coasters these are pineapples you get four you could either get them in yellow or in pink they also had the large leaf in the dark green or the light green and again, you get four in each pack. Then they had the 16 count pack of cocktail umbrellas. Also some different color plastic shot glasses in pink, purple, green, and blue. They had the drink stirs. They had some flamingos. 
Um, there were three different styles of flamingos. They also had palm trees and pineapples and then um, cactus. You either get four or ten, depending on which pack you get. Some children's cubs that look like mermaid tails and seashells. There were also these large drinking glasses with um, popsicles on the one. One says summer vibes. And then the third one has just a bunch of different um, like tropical leaves on it. They also had their fishnet in the white and in the green. Their um, ice cream cone plates, they have them in blue, pink, green, and purple. They had matching uh, napkins. You get 16 napkins, but only eight plates. Also, they had their fruit-shaped plates. They had these out last year. They had the ice cream uh, cone plates out last year also. You get the coordinating uh, napkins to go with these also. And they had their larger dinner napkins with the um, sweet summer popsicles. Those match the taller cups that I showed you guys with like the summer vibes and the popsicles. Also, they had some that were just like green with white polka dots. They brought back a bunch of their plastic drink cups, um, you know, for like tropical drinks and things like daiquiris and whatnot. Um, and the bright colors, you just get one for $1.25. You could also get uh, the ones that have the flowers attached to them already. And they're kind of like in the jewel tones with the clear plastic. Or you can get the four count pack of the smaller cups in the green, blue. They also had them in pink. And you get four of those for $1.25. The larger cups with the um, coconuts, the tiki heads. And then the kids' cups with the palm trees, pineapples, and flamingos. They also had some new luau signs. This one says relax. It's got the gnome on it in the back of a truck, which I thought was really cute. He's got a surfboard and a toucan. It says aloha. Also, this one here says tiki time with the jeep. The large um, triangle or diamond-shaped sign. This one here that says time to relax. It's round. And then they have a watermelon that says sweet summertime, the lemon that says squeeze the day. Also island time, it's a pineapple. The ones that look like they're in a um, tropical drink. This one just says tropical bliss. And then they have the large flip flop that says hello summer and welcome to paradise. They also have their large plastic flamingos for the yard. This year they have like yellow on the beak. They have the tinsel flamingos that will sit on a tabletop and the two different color pineapples. And now they have this new section called Shore Living. I'm assuming it's just out for summer, but you can get these really beautiful bottles in three colors of blue. They all have a um, raffi, or I'm sorry, a twine tag on them with a little white wooden fish attached so cute also the uh little bottles here where you can collect sand it says sand from my favorite beach or wish upon a star and they all have the cork on top and it's got the twine bow wrapped around the top you get the light blue the dark blue and then they had these small pillows i want to say they're like an eight by eight inch pillow they have a hanger on them so you could hang them up has a bunch of like anchors starfish they had seahorses some coral and they were all in the white and dark navy blue And they had these sand dollars. They're not real sand dollars. We get three for $1.25, which I thought was a great price. I actually bought some of those. Um, they have these large signs that look like a um, sailboat. There's two different ones. I love how the um, wood was kind of like a corrugated look. Some of the um, signs are a large square that have a wood beaded hanger at the top. And they use like seashells and sand dollars and starfish to make letters on the signs. They all have a bunch of different sayings on them. But a lot of them are like the natural wood, the dark blue, the light blue, um, 
colors with like maybe like a little bit of a gray kind of mixed in the background. Um, they have a whole bunch of different ones with different sayings. So I'm trying to show all of the ones that I found. Now, all of the short living items that I'm showing you are not at one store. I went to five different stores and this is a collective um you know, section here. So each store had their own individual items. And so I just took pictures of everything they had at each store. Some of them, of course, had all of the same things, like they would have two or three signs that were the same or some of the little clips or even the glass jars. And then other uh, stores had different signs and like tabletop uh, signs and things like that. So it really just depended on which store I was at, what they were carrying. So please don't expect to find every one of these items at the same store. Like I said, I went to five different stores in order to find all the different signs and bins and things that they were putting out. And I, there's still more. I didn't get all of it. They were still stocking it. So there's quite a bit that they have that they're putting out in the short living section. It's so like these signs right here have like a faux metal mermaid on the front of it, um, which was really pretty. These are like a stretched canvas, kind of like the um, old pictures they used to carry. Here's a view of the back of it so you guys could see what I'm talking about. I'm sure you've seen something similar to that at Dollar Tree before, just not with the beachy type theme. So there were a couple of those. I love these signs. It's like a three stacked, you know, kind of like tiered sign. There were two different ones of those with different sayings on the front. But you can see how all the color schemes kind of match and go together with the same like light blue, dark blue, gray, and some um, like weathered white. I love this large seahorse sign. And there are these three signs um, that have the faux metal on the front. It says like seize the day, wish upon a starfish. And then each one has a different background. Like this one has the palm trees. The starfish one has the starfish on the background behind the metal. And the first one that said seize the day has the... Um, seashells in the background they also had these galvanized metal signs with the curled edges it already has the twine hanger attached at the top so they had a starfish um a seahorse and an anchor and then they are just held on with like this little bent metal piece that's attached it looks like they could be easily removed if you wanted to use the sign for something else other than like shore living type decor you could remove it and use the sign for something else they also had these metal bins that say um lake life with the anchor it's got like the words raised up off of the side and kind of like a whitewash uh look over the aluminum they also had one that said wish upon a starfish or you can get the chalkboard signs here um, the center is a chalkboard with the metal around the outside it's got the seashell style kind of like drawings engraved around uh, the outside frame of the chalkboards they all also have a twine hanger already attached to those then they have the larger metal uh, seashell or you can get a lighthouse Then they had these small clips of the sailboats. You get five. It has um, already been painted and it has the clothespin attached to the back. And then the seahorses, you get six. There's three blue and then three with like a wood stain. And here are the starfish. They are a light blue with dark blue polka dots. Just the natural color fish. You get five in that pack and five of the mermaids. The whales, you also get five. They have their kind of like table scatter, just wood cut out pieces. I found dolphins and seashells. I showed you guys those last week. They also have these large anchors with the hanger already attached. You can get them in white. There's a view of it from the back so you guys can see. They're a decent size anchor. And they're about an inch thick. You can get them in dark navy blue and they also have them in red. And you can get the nautical twine to match those. I showed them in last week's video. Last week I also showed you guys they had these melamine plates, extra large serving bowls. They had like cereal bowls, drying mats, tablecloths, um, hot pad holders, uh, oven mitts they had the kitchen towels the large serving platters and then the dinner plates 
Here are the hand towels. There's the sea sand one, and then the other one that says wish upon a starfish. They also had the stemless glasses, which are BPA free, and there's two of them. Also the large tags with the cork on the front. It has like an octopus. Here's a view of the top so you guys could see that a little bit better. Again, I showed a few of these last week. I just want you to have them all in one place. Also one that has coral on the front. Then these large DIY signs. The red one with the sailboat, white with the seashell. The blue one is a starfish. And then the natural colored wood is the seahorse. And the navy blue is an anchor. And here they are all hanging side by side. They also have these tabletop words that say breathe, relax, and beach. You can get them in the whitewash white, the natural wood, and they also have them in a light gray, which were already sold out. It seems like the gray was definitely the favorite. They have these DIY tabletop signs, uh, the sand and me with the whale at the top, and then sun take me to the ocean. Also the DIY um, steering wheel for the ship. They had the anchor and the seahorse and some mermaids. Also some mermaid tails that you could DIY. So lots and lots of these shore living items. And I'm sure there's more to come. Over in the toys, games, and entertainment this week, they had these wacky tracks um, for $1.25. They had a couple different colors. Also the stretchy dough balls which were the sensory toys. You can get them in the neon colors. They had them in orange, neon pink, and neon green. Then there were these extra large um, chalk pencils that were so cute. They've got like the eraser at the top and you can put the large chalk in the end and hold it to help you um, draw outside. The character bubbles, they had a fireman, a princess, or, and a mermaid, and also a construction worker. They also had some new Barbie furniture. Um, this is the outdoor furniture play set. So they have like a beach chair with a side table and they are white and pink. They also had the table with the chairs and the umbrella. So you get the umbrella by itself and then you have to buy the table and chairs separate, which does come together in this little bag here. And you just pop those together. So you can see them on the tag. It says it fits most regular size Barbies. And then they also had this pink outdoor grill. For the Dollar Tree Plus items, those are the $3 to $5 items, which most Dollar Trees do have now. They have these extra large bins in uh, dark blue, red, uh, light blue, white, and gray. They're 10 gallons. Also, these extra large bags with the faux like wicker on this side. They had them in dark blue, gray, white, and a seafoam kind of green color and these were huge they were actually about the same size as the laundry baskets which i'll show you here when i take a picture they were only three dollars however the other ones that i showed the 10 gallon ones those were five then they had these large outdoor signs those are five dollars each and some beach towels this week they had a star wars beach towel for five dollars And then these are so cute. They're a large bouncy ball covered in fur. They're called Furry Friends. They are $5 each. They had a chick, a unicorn, and a pig. And if you have made it all the way to the end of this video, you are a trooper. I know it was a long one this week, but there was lots to show. Don't forget, I post new videos every Friday showing what's new for the week at the Dollar Tree. And then I do DIY videos, which I post on Thursday. So here's a few of the items that we've made over the last few weeks just to give you some idea of the things that we make and I try to use mainly items from the Dollar Tree. I am considering starting to do Dollar Tree videos twice a week to shorten them up just a little bit. Let me know what you guys think about that in the comments down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. And here are some other videos from our channel that you might also enjoy. Have a great weekend everyone.